Blessings and blessings from Byron Bay, Australia. Uh, today's transmission is really about our emotions, but I want to come at it in a different way. And I want to say this, a lot of people buy a lot of programs and they do a lot of stuff that isn't actually solving the issue they have. For example, somebody who's experiencing a lot of stress will go and think that buying a daily calendar uh, or journal will be the thing that would help them eliminate the stress. And that's like rearranging the chairs on the Titanic. The ship is gonna sink no matter what. You may make it a little less stressful when you're drowning, but you're still gonna drown to death. The game is to create emotional literacy, which creates emotional intelligence, which then creates emotional agility. And emotional agility is when we can be with our emotions in such a way that we use them as information. We use them as information as to what the body, the soul, is asking of us. I think that a lot of us have become repressive. We've become like little mini Hitlers within our beingness, trying to repress every emotion that comes up and trying to solve the emotions with numbing out through television, social media, alcohol, sex. We numb out and we repress and we deny these emotions. And then when we get finally get fed up, we throw something at it that has nothing to do with the thing. So I say all that to say, take a look at it. Next time you have some emotion coming up, some anger, some sadness, some sexual feelings, ask yourself, what is this trying to teach me? What is this trying to show me about myself, about my life, about how I've set my life up? It may be actually a really beautiful conversation. And for those of you who want to go even deeper, if you're a man, holler at me, man cave, prestonsmods.com forward slash man cave. Or if you're a man or a woman and you want to do six months of emotional intelligence, emotional literacy, and emotional agility work with myself and my ninja coaches, uh, prestonsmiles.com forward slash stretch 22. Blessings and blessings from Byron Bay. I love you all so much. And if you're new to the family, click subscribe. Peace.